into Eagle Pass illegally, but are being blocked by the Texas National Guard with rows of razor wire. Well, right behind them, if we can pan the camera around, there's another group in the water right now, as I'm speaking to you, trying to cross illegally. Pretty close to where that group is. You'll see another group of illegal immigrants streaming into the river here in Eagle Pass. A body was just recovered here a short time ago. You can see uh, more migrants streaming down the Mexican side of the shore down to the river's edge, right in front of the Mexican National Guard, right in front of Mexican police, who are doing nothing to stop it. This is something I've been mentioning uh, the last two days in a row. Uh, the Mexicans have law enforcement posted up at the edge of the river, but you can see they're not really doing anything. These people just show up at the river's edge, they walk down to the edge of the river, they get into the water, then they cross over to the U.S. side. Now, there's been a little bit of a tug of war going on between Texas and the federal government. You see, Texas does not want to let any of these migrants in. They are deploying razor wire. They are not letting people in. Border Patrol yesterday cut some of that wire to allow some migrants in. Sometimes they do that when they feel that there's uh, safety issues involved. But you can see what's going on with this live drone right now, guys. This has been playing out since sunrise out here in Eagle Pass. Nonstop groups, nonstop illegal crossings here. And as some try to get into the United thank States, you for watching. Please subscribe for more. And thank you, new subscribers. As well. we also want to show Welcome you aboard, like Patriots. Show the channel some love by here. subscribing. I it started after sunrise. It has been non stop. More migrants in the water crossing illegally, predominantly single adults from Venezuela is what we're seeing. Some of them have been carrying uh, Venezuelan flags as they cross illegally into the United States. Um, this has been going on since yesterday when we had over 3,000 people cross all at the same time. One of the biggest mass crossings we've seen since two years ago in Del Rio, Texas. You can see that as they stream into Eagle Pass, they gather under the International Bridge here. It's very nonchalant. That's what's bizarre about all this. You notice people aren't running. It's, people aren't going crazy all over the place. It's just like a single file line of people walking down and crossing into Texas illegally because they expect to be released and back out here live to that point mass catch and release is the policy of the biden administration here at the southern border the border patrol union just tweeted out an hour ago that in the last three weeks alone more than 100,000 migrants have been released into the united states they say that is a huge pull factor and that is why so many people are deciding to cross illegally we'll send it back to you uh, Bill, when I was covering the border crisis back in 2014, if you saw a group of 10 people... Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more. These days, if you see a group of 10 people, it's rare because it's mostly dozens, hundreds, or thousands. God bless. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Thanks, Patriots.